We step back in time through the doorways of some of Chicago's most historic homes. You can do just that by taking part in a walking tour. This tour is called Historic Homes, Cottages and Buildings of Wicker Park. We've got Ronnie Fry and Ronnie has an Instagram page called Doorways of Chicago. This tour was his creation. Hey, thanks for coming on. Yeah, you're welcome. Nice to be here. OK, tell us, you know, what do you want people to know about this experience? What's the experience you want to give them? So the experience is going to be, um, there's a lot of workers' cottages on the tour, which is like the one behind me, and they have a lot of uh, Chicago history. But I'm also going to be talking about uh, a lot of different notable properties and other homes and buildings that have historic uh, qualities and nature in uh, the Booker Park area. Look, you had a really cool job, and we're looking at these images, and uh, they're just beautiful. <laughs> Apparently, you're not only a photographer, you do a little interior design. So I'm just wondering, yes. um, you know, is there is there, are there favorites of yours? Do you have one or two that uh, that even take your breath away? You mean in Wicker Park? Yeah. Yeah, uh, I love the. There's a house over on Pierce Avenue that's kind of uh, Germanic in nature. Um, and then there's also the, the John Rapp House, which is on Hoyne, uh, which is a second empire home that is uh, enormous and just beautiful. Uh, it's been beautifully restored. It used to be apartments, but now it's back to single family. So those are two of my favorites. Nice. Why did you choose Wicker Park? Uh, actually, it was, I have a, a tour in Old Town as well. And then um, the person that lives in the house behind me, Leah, she contacted me and asked me when I was going to take a picture of her worker's cottage. And then she said, you need to do a tour in Worker Park. So that's how that all came about. And I love Worker Park anyway, so it was a natural. I always tell people, and I brag about it, I've taken the architectural tour three times. I absolutely love it every time I do it. Does it have that sort of feel? Are you walking people down the street sort of describing the architecture and, and a little bit of the backstory behind it? Yeah, I'll be talking about a lot of the details on the homes, uh, the architectural features, as well as the history of, uh, if we know the history of the people that lived there and that built the homes. All right, well, tell me this then, because this is a, a Chicago question. Why do we have so many cottage homes in the Chicago area? I mean, it's in the burbs, too. What, what, what is it about the cottage homes that we always see these, you know, sprout up here yeah, in Chicago? It, it, it's so interesting, because in the uh, Industrial Revolution in the 1850s, uh, there were so many immigrants that were moving into the Chicago area when Chicago was growing so quickly to work at the meatpacking plants and the grain industry and the railroad uh, industry. And they needed places to live. And these cottages are really easy to build. They're small little A-frame structures. And so they built a lot of these. And they did a lot of them like this, where the first floor is actually on the second floor. And then they would rent the lower level to a tenant to help pay for the rent. But you could buy one of these for $125, wow. uh, fully furnished. Ten dollars down and one hundred twenty-five dollars a month. So, uh, <laughs> I would yeah, that time machine again. I guess back to those prices. <laughs> hey, real quick, we're out of time. But how does somebody how does somebody find the tour? How do they find you? Um, they can find it on my website, uh, doorwaysofchicago.com, and there's a tour uh, section on my website. And then they are also on Eventbrite. Uh, so you can search for Doorways of Chicago and Eventbrite, or you can just type in Workers' Cottage and they come up too. Awesome. I love it. Great job on, on coming up with this idea. Ronnie Fry, uh, Instagram page, Doorways of Chicago, and this tour again, his creation. Good job out there. I learned something about Chicago I didn't know.